Hello and welcome! Nice of you to tune in again for today's show and as soon as my companion sorry. decides to show up. Sorry, Finn. You're right, you look nice. Sorry. Oh, well, wow. you don't. Sorry, you I, had really to see don't. A man, I had to see a man about a dog. A that's not, seat, man, that's not even a reference that's of not poo. That's such that a bad excuse, Paul. That's there was such a man a bad and his dog, it was messy. <laughs> Hi, hello everyone and welcome to URC TV. Yes, which is the only TV channel that is exclusive for the Uni University of Cumbria. I'm Paul Kemp. And I'm Finn Street. And you might have noticed some slight changes from last week's episode. Indeed, yes. because from this week on we will have a studio. Mm -hmm. We will have a script, which you might have noticed down there, but it's really nice to know what you're going to say. And Paper. we're going to have an actual, like, a massive crew. Yes. Hello, crew. Hello, crew. Nice to see you. Hi, crew. I could, that crew member doesn't look happy, <laughs> but doesn't matter. Anyway, let's see what's coming up on this week's show. I went down uh, to uh, the Learning Gateway at Diesel Street to check out the welcome fair. We join Lakshabantua when she gets locked in a shopping centre. That sounds slightly illegal. And we send some people down to Denton Home where they had a look at some art exhibition. I mean, Paul, isn't that all fantastic? It's fantastic. We've got seats, Lovely. we've got a studio, it's, it's fantastic. warm, it's we don't have to yes. stand outside yes. in okay. the cold. Yeah. No, Finn, I'm it's, it's really okay. enjoying myself today. I know, I know, Finn. I really am. These are really nice jeans, by the way. Oh, thank you. Anyway, next up is the fair at Fuse Hill, which you went to. Yes, yes. exactly. I myself went down to uh, Fuse Hill Street Campus to have a look at this year's Freshers' Fair and just see, like, you know, I was talking to students and see what people thought about it. Yes, yeah, so take it away, Finn. Is there? Hello and good morning. I'm here this fine and cold morning in front of the Learning Gateway of Fusil Street to have a look at this year's Freshers Fair. It's going to be a really exciting morning and I'm really looking forward to it. So ha let's have a look inside and see what is going on in there. I'm Emily and I am volunteering for the Samaritans. We just listen. We, you know, so whenever you have too many problems, too much on your mind, or even just want to chat with somebody, you can give us a call. Uh, I'm Matt Tennant. I'm one of the sabbatical officers here at Cumbria. And what's your job today? Uh, my job today is uh, to just NASA with some of the students, tell them about what the student union is doing, uh, direct them to the right place. Uh, we've got a lot of people who seem a bit overwhelmed with it. So it's just making sure they go to the right places, pick up the right freebies and stuff. I'm Katie and I'm from the National Blood Service and we're here to recruit blood donors. Um, do you get a lot of students already to sign up? We do, we get an awful lot of students. We go to Freshers Fairs all over Lancashire and Cumbria. Yeah. Right everyone, Francis is going to do 20 shots of extra hot sauce. <laughs> he is a legend. Enjoying Freshers Fair? I'm loving it so far. What's what's your favourite store? Would you say? Well, I've just been to the, to the Nando store. I want like a free drink there as well, so I'm looking forward to that. Do you think the variety of stores is alright? Are you missing something? I don't think so. Uh, I, I, th I think I, th I think everything is here. I, I've seen some NHS stuff, some music stuff. I think the sports stuff is over the other, the other way, so I, I, think, I think everything's here. I'm here for Central Ambulance, basically promoting our student volunteering and our links unit that we're going to be running on campus. Um, so you say student volunteering, what do students do when they volunteer for you? Uh, when they come along we train them first aid and then we basically take them out on duty with us and get them to get their hands dirty. So places like Kendall Calling, music festivals, um, Carlisle Fire Show, uh, anything from a village fete to a rally event. Right, this is the end of my Freshest Fair experience. I must say, it was really, really interesting. It was really fun. I learned a lot of things. I got a lot of things. I'm really happy with holiday, and I hope you enjoy watching it. Good night. So, see, 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 this is what I don't get. You didn't sign up, yet you got all that free stuff. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, it does. I mean, like, come on, look at me. Handsome guy. Charming guy. 
good looking good, guy. Yeah. It no, has been seen all the time, but all the time. You're like, I'm walking through a factory and just people stopping me like, oh, mm. have a biscuit. And I'm like, yeah, have a biscuit, Finn. I like that. <laughs> have a biscuit. Have a biscuit, Finn. Yeah, it's, it's like, it's kind of like my motto, you know, it's yeah. just like, hi, I'm Finn H Street. Oh, have a biscuit. Oh, have a biscuit, Finn. Yeah. Have a biscuit. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so speaking of food, can, you know, can, can I have some of that pasta? No, but, no, you can't. But I, I've not had lunch. Okay, whatever. I'll just starve. Anyway, if you want to get involved with anything you saw in that video, then go on the website, which is www.ucsu.me. Yes, because there are loads of opportunities to sign up for stuff. And so, you know, the thing about it, that's the main reason to go to university. It's all about opportunities. So sign up and you may even get some free stuff, like free pasta like me. Or if your name's Paul, maybe not. But I really want some pasta, Finn. No, you're not getting in. I love pasta! Shut up, Paul! Anyway, <laughs> we caught up with Alaksha Bantua as she got locked in a local shopping centre called The Lanes and we're going to see what she got up to. I reckon she got up to a lot <laughs> of illegal things. Anyway, let's find out. Hey everyone, this is Lax Bantua and today we're here in The Lanes for the lockdown. The Lanes Lock-In is a fantastic student shopping night with live music, DJs, brilliant games and student discounts from over 36 retailers inside the centre. Right, so we've heard about this student discounts and everything. Let's go and speak to some students if they've actually found some bargains. So, can you tell us your names, please? Uh, my name's Hannah. My name's Laura. And what have you guys got today? I, I bought a top and a jumper. That is really vintage, I like it. Yeah, I love, I love my room. It's to keep me warm, because it's cold here in Cumbria. <laughs> there we go. We have some guys in the show, so can you tell me your names, please? Yeah, I'm Matt. I'm here, Peter. I'm Matt as well. Okay, and how's the event been? What have you got bought today? I bought uh, some toothpaste and a book. Got some uh, hair products, some uh, bars of soap, Imperial Leather, a very good brand. <laughs> uh, it really gets you clean in the morning. And uh, a roll on deodorant as well. Yeah, that's it. Roll on. And some, and some Listerine mouthwash. This is so disappointing. It's okay, we're outside phones for you, with the phones for you staff. Do you want to tell us your names? Uh, Nathan. Patrick. Okay, so how's it been today? Hectic or...? It's been quite busy actually, we've done very, very well. Um, lots of Give us a figure, how much have you done? <laughs> we can't, do that. We can't, we can't say the figures, can't say the figures. Yeah. We've done more than expected, I'll say that, more than expected. Okay. Right guys, we've come to the end of the night and um, I've had loads of fun, but I want to do some shopping now. So I'm going to sign out and this is it, back to the studio. So we here at UOCTV, we do have a strict no swearing and no obscenity policy. Yes, so every time we do accidentally swear, either in the studio or on the field, like if I would say to Paul now, yes, Paul, sir. I want you to know you're an absolute Say what? That will be plate. It would, yes. Uh, we do this because it just basically upholds a kind of professionalism and it's basically the rules of television. We can't control it. It's out of our controls. But... Yeah. When we're faced with a feature like this, it kind of does pose some problems. Yes, because the next VT took place in the Atlas Works and uh, there was a fine art exhibition down there for uh, new students at the university. It was, and the title of said show was A Shell, A Shell, A <laughs> Shell. Yes, so we can actually say f but we can't let you hear f because mm -hmm. of a f policy. Yeah. So every time we do say f you won't hear f because you just hear the f bleep if I say f Anyway, so <laughs> we're just going to have to... <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have to present this and just say a shell, a shell, a shell. I'm Max, I run the galley, I do many things, um, all exciting things. Here at the moment we've got the first year drawing show exhibition, which is the culmination of the first three weeks of their projects. Um, the first couple of weeks they get set some very intensive drawing sort of studies where they have to sort of break the ice, get to the point, reach the limit of how well they can draw, and go further and further and further. Well, the brief was about putting an object in a space and we had to work out how that really comes, like the composition of that on a paper and, and how 
how we would work out about how the what lines and marks would make on the page. Jake, I think, um, he's done a piece of art and it's quite illustrative and I really liked it. I thought it was really, really good. I thought it was really good. cool use of um, colour within the kind of black and white, so it's really cool. Basically, I found friends a sort of scrap card. Adds drama. It gives it a lot. Everyone loves a bit of drama. If you want to get in, involved with you or CTV in any way, uh, just contact us whether or not it's um, presenting, production, advertising, technical, anything. Uh, please do contact one of your representatives. Yes, yes, and also don't forget to like us, follow us and subscribe us on Twitter and Facebook. And if you want to talk about today's show on Twitter, please use our hashtag, which is hashtag EOCTV. Yes, but anyway, um, be before we go, I actually, I'm sorry. I'm on this one, yeah. I need to leave early because okay. I need to find my car. Okay. Because it's, it's behind the set somewhere. Yeah. And uh, so if you want to close the show, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, would fine. that be yeah, alright? Yeah, okay, sorry it. guys. Absolutely. Sorry everyone. That's cool, that's cool. Yeah. Well, to be honest, but I didn't expect sorry. anything else from you. Like, no, I am I'm I'm professional as you are. You are indeed. But anyway, yeah. sorry, you go and close the show. Anyways, guys, now with that person out of the way, if you think that I should be the only one presenting this show, just give me a message on Facebook and have a good week. Um, it's, it's just a set bit.